Well, hello friends, how are you doing? So today I am so excited to share with you my spring bulb haul. So I have two items from Brex and the rest I got from Tulip World. Oh my goodness, I am so excited. I absolutely love their products. But first, let me go over what I ordered from Brex with you. In the box, they sent the 2024 spring preview. Oh my goodness, I can't wait to go through this and see all the cool looking plants they have in here. But anyways, let's go through the few things I got. Oh, and they send this also, give your plants the best chance. Thank you for your order. Oh, that's so cute. Um, let's see what we have here. Okay, and this is good. It's just an instructional guide. They just tell you what to do when you plant it and what to do if planting must be delayed. It just show you different tips. So that's good if you're a beginner gardener or you just need a reminder. If you're a seasoned gardener, this is a handy guide in here for you to look at. Anyways, so, and I'm gonna insert pictures on the screen for you because I know I could just be showing you this green bag with some bulbs, but what's the point if I don't show you what the bulbs will look like, right? So this, is the 12 bulbs this is a cool shade dutch irish mixture this i will plant in full sun to partial shade and you know sometimes it's hard to get spring bulbs that require shaded areas so i was excited when i found this i had to do some research and i found this so these are gonna go i think i'll probably put most of them in the shaded area and these will bloom late spring to early summer and they will grow 20 to 24 inches tall. And it's a plant four inches deep. It's a gorgeous Dutch irises in shimmering shades of blue, lilac, and white. So these are going to be a combination of those colors. I'm so excited to see them. And from just looking through, it looks like the bulbs look very healthy. So that's one thing when i open the bags i'll inspect them and if there's any rat in the bulb or anything in here you reach out to the company they're pretty good with honoring a replacement for you so i'm not too concerned about that but i never had any issues with them anyways so then this one i think this one was a new one but this is the kenron daffodil and as i said i put the picture on the screen for you it says plant in full sun to partial shade mid to late spring foreign they will grow 12 to 14 inches high and you plant six deep and this is the bronze yellow petal with vibrant orange cup so i was very excited about this because you know i have the traditional daffodils with the yellow and the white but this one i'm so excited about the color and if you look closely do you see that that's a green point already see the green there so these i'll be putting in the ground soon so make sure you're subscribed so i can share that with you and then friends let's look at this one this one is from tulip this was a large order and i did a video sharing my aldi haul bulb haul so i'll link that for you down below where the prices were amazing at aldi grocery store can you believe that anyways so these i ordered oops, looks like the bag is open there so these i ordered since i think it's probably in the summer maybe june i ordered these so they only ship to you according to your zip according to your zone i mean zone 6b so they send these according to when it's time for you to plant so i'll be doing a spring order soon so my spring order will not come until next year so that's how it works right anyways let's see what's going on here okay looks like my bag is open so i have to go through and make sure i have 25 bulbs in here but this one is a prince or min and this one i'll be planting four to six inches deep and this will bloom mid spring and this is a beautiful yellow and orange color so now i'm done with all my bulbs i have to go around the garden and assess where i'm gonna put them so it makes sense in terms of the colors and the blooming time and then here's another Prince Almond. I got two of these. And can you see here? I can see, can you see how big these bulbs are? They're huge. And remember friends, you have to plant these in 
fall now in order for the cold air to activate these for you to get the blooms next year okay and if you don't plant them now what i've done before i've actually kept some in my garage my garage is not heated i've kept some in there and then i in like february i put them in planters and there's no issue but wherever you keep these make sure you keep them in a cold area or uh, even the bottom of your fridge right make sure there's no fruits or veggies in there anyways so i got two of these let's see what i have here and then this is the mixed triumph this is your traditional colors but i love that it comes in all different colors and these will grow 12 to 24 inches high and these also bloom mid-spring and once again look at the bulbs in here these so healthy they look okay i think okay and this is the drumstick allium oh my goodness and if I have any picture from my garden earlier in the year, I'll definitely insert for you. But I planted these and I love them so much that I had to get more. These are 25 in the bag. Look at this. And they look like they will grow up to 28 inches tall. And these are the purple color. 22 to 28 inches tall. And these are the purple. And allium, they're related to the onion family. So I can actually smell like, <laughs> they smell like onions. <laughs> and then here's another bag of the Triumph mixed tulip and these are perfect as cut flowers okay your triumph if you're looking for cut flower tulips always try to get the triumph one they make the perfect cut flower because they're so tall they grow up to 24 12 to 24 inches tall so the stem is pretty long so you definitely always want to make sure you get the triumph tulip with a long stem and then here is this one this is the miranda tulip this will grow 18 to 24 inches tall and this blooms mid spring and this is the red red is such a striking color in your garden friends okay don't sleep on red red adds that pop of color to your garden and let's see what i have here and then here we have the oh i'm going to saw some pictures for you i got more of the allium purple sensation oh my goodness i love 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 this okay this is a showstopper. You have to get allium in your garden. And these grow 12 to 24 inches tall. And this is the purple also. You have to get these in your garden. I love these so much. I got three bags. That's 75 purple sensation alliums. Oh my goodness. I can't wait for spring. Look at this. And you can see the bulbs are looking healthy too. I'm telling you, friends, I'm so excited. I love spring bulbs and I just love it. Oh, and guess what? Least but not last, look what I have here. This is the Aurora Fritillaria. Excuse my pronunciation. There's the name there. This will go 32 to 39 inches tall. This is so striking. This is a must. If I have to recommend any spring bulbs, the Allium and this one, they're a must okay you have to get these in your garden and this is the orange and as always i'll put this stuff on the screen for you and these bulbs are huge look at them huge i i couldn't wait to get these bulbs i can't wait to plant these i'll be planting these very soon so make sure you subscribe so i can share that with you and let me know in the comments down below what are you planting oh did you order for, have you ever ordered from tulip wall before Brex? Tulip Paul and Bricks, I've always ordered from them and I've never had an issue with those companies. And Tulip Paul always have great sale going on, okay? Great sale. You get a good discount with them. Anyway, friends, I just wanted to share this with you and I'll see you in the next one. All right, cheers.